and welcome back to Let's Play Story of Seasons Trio of Towns. Alright, tonight is the Starlight Gala. We just have to be there by 8. That means we pretty much have the entire day to spend doing whatever. Actually, there is one thing I want to do. Actually, wait, no, it's way too early for that. I still haven't gotten the tablet. Hopefully... Ooh, actually, wait. It is a holiday, but it's a West Town holiday. So I think we should be able to get it today. Eh, I'll go give it a try later. For now, let's just take care of all the crops. Uh, broccoli's not ready yet. Speaking of broccoli, how many inventory slots do I have left? Eleven. And that should be enough. Yeah, I think maybe on the very last day of the season, I'm just gonna sell everything I have. And then we'll just see what we Oh, actually, no, I do want it to end up in this season. Actually, no, it'll be easier to see how much I make if I just start off the next season with the money. Yeah, I think on the very last day, I am just going to see how much money I can get for selling everything valuable. Also, I did double check who I'm spending New Year's with now. Probably going to be West Town, to be honest, because last year we spent with Lulu Coco. And yeah, as much as I like Tsukusa, I think West Town should be the one we end with. They were the very first town we uh, basically participa participated with. The very first town we interacted with. Kind of makes sense that they would be the last one, too. Anyways, let's just finish up down here. Actually, wait, if I finish up quickly enough, I could run inside and just grab some breakfast real quick. Also, my melons died. I did not realize my melons were there that long. Okay. Well, I could replant, but at this point, yeah, I think it's fine. We don't have to replant. Huh. I, yeah, I thought the melons were a lot more recent than that. Oh well, but let's grab some breakfast real quick. And we'll have Saluka cook for us. Actually, have we had a I think we've had a few me meals like this since uh, Pippi was born. Unfortunately, I don't think- yeah, Pippi's still not old enough to actually join us. That's a shame. Also, sometimes Saluka will ask you if you want anything specific. This was not one of those times. Alright. But that was a pretty uneventful breakfast. Alright, so let's go finish up our work, take care of the animals, and then run to town for a bit. Because, yeah, I just need to wait until 8 o'clock for the Starlight Gala. And I think this year, I think we should probably spend it with Ford. Because last year, we spent it with Wayne, I believe. And I kind of want to give both Bachelors or West Town a chance to interact with us on the hot air balloon. Plus, I don't know. I like Ford. Also, I kind of like most of the Bachelors in this game. Honestly, I'm not a huge fan of the Suyakusa Bachelors. They're just kind of generic to me. I don't know why. Actually, a lot of the Suyak... Actually, no, that's not true. I like a lot of the Suyakusa people. Anyways, let's just grab our milk. Grab the milk, grab the wool. Actually, I should also double check to see if anyone's super stressed out at the moment. Where's my clippers? There it is. I don't think anyone is, but let's just be sure. Actually, you know what? I don't think I did any brushing yesterday. Also, I need to clean up in here. Uh, actually, no. The only one that's kind of stressed out is garlic. Oh, and my llama. My llama's always stressed out. I guess being a llama is just extremely stressful. Maybe he just kind of feels left out just being out in the corner like that. But everyone else should be good. Alright, let's get that wool. Uh, I really need to remember where my clippers are. For some reason, I can never find my clippers when I want to. I don't know why. Hi, rabbit. Here, I'll wait for the rest to be outside. Let's go take care of our uh, southern crops. Oh, I also have some daikon seeds in the maker. Because I think, yep, they're ready. Actually, I think I need to make more daikon seeds. Because, how many do I have in my inventory right now? Three. And then there are ten in the uh, seed maker. Yeah, I'm going to need to make more. That's not nearly enough.
How many Daikon do I have at the moment? Probably a ton. Yep, that has a lot of Daikon. Yeah, you need to turn a couple more into seeds. I would go buy... Actually, maybe I can just go buy some. Although, yeah, it'd be cheap just to turn them into seeds. I have the Daikon to spare. But yeah, I don't remember if Suikusa and Lunga Koko are open today. I think they are, because it's not a three-town festival. Alright, ten more should be enough. Alright, as for you two, let's do our milking. Also, I accidentally zoomed in the camera. Whoops. I can fix that. There we go. Alright, got my milk. Let's get that wool, and then we'll do a bit of brushing, and then probably go finish up the fields, and then head to town for a bit. I'm trying to think if there's any other, like, major events I haven't seen yet. There are still a couple familiar events we could trigger, but... I don't know if I can trigger one more before the year ends. Because I believe they're, like, ten... I forget if they're ten or twenty days apart. I believe it's twenty days. Anyways, uh, seeds are still being made. Also, if I really want to maximize profits, I can stick all that milk into the cheese maker. It would only take, like, a month to go through it all. Yeah, you know what, I'm just gonna keep it as milk for now. Alright, so how many seeds is that? Uh, 18. That might be enough? Yeah, I think I'm, that might be enough. Let me go see. If not, I can just run up and grab the rest. Also, apparently my Daikon have been slowly... Oh, yeah, they have slowly been improving. Because of the whole, uh, what is it? Because of the farm sort combination in this area. Kind of forgot about that, to be honest. Oh, that's actually pretty good. So, yeah, it's a slow process, but it does slowly improve your crops. The one I have is size up, I think. Okay, yeah, I'm getting more seeds. I kind of underestimate just how many fields I have. I need three more. Actually, they should be done by now. Also, I'm almost out of energy again. Unfortunately, there's no way to reduce the energy use for planting. We can't exactly take our seeds to Ludus and upgrade them. That would be amusing, but yeah, that's not how it works. Just stick an iron bar in the bag. That'll make them easier to throw. Alright, let's get these water and then we'll head to town. Ooh, actually, yeah, I don't know if I have enough stamina for this. Do I have any food on me? I have one piece of chocolate fondue. That was the last one. Alright, crops are watered. Are these done yet, by the way? Yes, they are. I don't know why I never harvested them before. That's the problem with wasabi and some of the paddy crops. Kind of hard to tell when they're actually done. But yeah, let's head to town. We have about, what, eight hours to kill? About seven, actually. So yeah, we're not gonna get anything done in West Town today, just simply because everything's closed. Let me just go see if everything's closed in the other two towns. Nope, they're open. They are open on Christmas Day. Well, Starlight Day, I guess. Alright, do you have my tablet, by the way? Oh, yeah, you do. Awesome. Yep, yeah, I've been talking to him every day to see if he had it. Alright, what is it? Sheep engraving one of the... Oh, oh, oh never mind. Sheep engraving one of them. 9,999. Sure, just, just give it to me. I think we could negotiate the price, but at this point, that's like literally nothing. Anyways, go the tablet. Engraving. Whatever. I mean, Mithra, I always buy it for you. Just take it. I'm gonna have to pay you later to, uh, you know, translate it anyway, so... Actually, I wonder, can we trigger that event now? I don't think so. I think they're already out of their house at this point. What time is it? 
Yeah, it's already 1.30 in the afternoon. They're probably not at home anymore. Nope, they're not home. Actually, can I trigger the event anyways just by going inside? No, okay, I'll have to come back in the morning then. That's okay. Oh, there is one other thing I want to do while I'm in the area. I just realized something. It's already the 25th of winter and we still have not seen a single blizzard. That's actually highly unusual. Here, I'm gonna see what the weather forecast is. Uh, I believe daikons are- yeah, they're a Suyakusa crop. Alright, tell me about the weather. Watch, we're gonna have two days of storms. Okay, snow tomorrow, and snow the day after. Oh my god, are we seriously gonna get through a winter without a single blizzard? Because, yeah, let me see. Tomorrow the 26th, 27th, 28th. We just have to survive about four days without a blizzard. And then we are home free, because there's never gonna be a blizzard on the 30th or 31st, because both are uh, festival days. Oh my god. I might be able to get through an entire winter without a single blizzard. That is really weird. Actually, no, it's not that weird. I did have one season in my casual file where I didn't have a single blizzard. Still, that is pretty unusual. Anyways, I have time. I'll take a bath. Oh, right, it was the wine bath day. Alright, two hours soaking in wine. Still not sure why that's a thing. Alright. Uh, what time is it? We have like four more hours. Let's see what else is happening around here. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna head to uh, West Town for a bit. See if anyone's around. I think everyone's just stuck at home. Yeah, stores are closed because holiday. And everyone's just hanging out at home, apparently. Hi, Ford. Wait, where's Ford? Oh, he's upstairs. That's right. I always forget sometimes that people live where they work in this game. Even Ford likes the Starlight Gala. Yeah, I think we're gonna spend the night with Ford tonight. Unfortunately, we can't bring uh, Saluka with us, because I don't know why, actually. That would have actually been a really cool reward. Like, once you max out all three towns, you can start bringing, like, people from other towns with you to, uh, town-specific festivals. Especially the romance ones. Oh well. But yeah, everyone else is just sitting at home. You know what, who, who we haven't really visited lately? We haven't seen Frank for a while. He was the one who taught us everything we know. Okay, no, he didn't actually teach me anything because I already knew everything, but... I think it's a good way to, like, spend a bit of time with him. Frank, I'm already married and I have kids. Kid. I have a kid. I think we'll be fine, Frank. Alright, let's head home. We could try having dinner. Actually, no, I don't think we'll be... Wait, what time does dinner start again? Is it 8 o'clock? Because, let me see, right now it's almost 6. Yeah, let me see if I can have dinner with Saluka before I head off. Where's Pippi? There's Pippi. Well, she's learning. Also, yeah, I don't think it's really responsible to leave her at home all day. I don't know. Seems like someone should be watching her. Hank doesn't count. Actually, wait, where is Hank? Where's the dog? Oh, I think I know where he is. He's probably outside hurting the animals. I hope he's outside hurting the animals. Oh yeah, we can have dinner with Samuka. Here, you know what? Let's make a good Starlight Gala feast for her. Do I have any good ingredients to use, actually, now that I think about it? Here, let me see what I can make. Which one of these would be really good for, like, a Christmas dinner? We could make spaghetti. 
Hmm, what says Christmas? Fish pie says Christmas. No, let's not make her a fish pie. That honestly sounds kind of disgusting. Uh, let me see. Can we make, like, a Christmas cake for her? We could make a vegetable cake. We could make pancakes. Oh, we could make her ice cream, actually. Eh, that might not be the best for, like, snowy weather. We could make her our award-winning uh, chocolate fondue. Oh, let's make melon cake. Yeah, that sounds like a good, like, Lulu Coco Christmas tradition. All we need is flour and a melon. Not gonna turn out that great because the flour kind of sucks. But yep, made her some melon cake along with some side dishes, which I can't tell what they are. Okay, we're getting better. Yeah, I think she'll always respond that way if it's like below three stars, I want to say. Actually, yeah, I think tomorrow I'm just going to make her like my award-winning chocolate fondue. It has won an award, so I get to call it that from now on. Along with my award-winning... What did I make before a fried egg? My award-winning egg and my award-winning whatever I cooked for the other contest. I can't remember. It was like a four-course meal, so it was probably a bunch of things. Alright, almost 8 p.m. Yep, don't worry. I'm ready. Man, it's almost over. Two more episodes after this, actually, now that I think about it. There's gonna be the Harvest Festival, and then I think I'm just gonna make New Year's its own festival. Or, episode. Wow, time flew by really fast with this LP. But enough talk about that. Let's go to the Starlight Gala. Oh, right, we get to deliver presents. I completely forgot about that. Oh, yeah, I just completely forgot about this, because this wasn't in the original game. Okay, then. We do get to spend time with Samuka. Last year, who did we deliver? Oh, last year we delivered it to the Suyakusa kids, I think. Yeah, unfortunately, you guys won't let me invite my wife, so... But yeah, we are going to go with Ford this time, because last time we went with Wayne. Wes Ford's a nice guy. A little cranky at first, but a really nice guy. Also, I just realized, who made all these snowmen? Yeah, I don't think Saluka would like it if I rode with Lizette. Actually, Stephanie's an option too now. Because, yeah, in the original, Lizette was nearly the only option to ride with in this uh, festival, if you're a male character. Still, I always like the romantic festivals in this game. They're really pretty. I always love the image of, like, a night starry sky. Don't really see them that often where I live, mostly because it's too bright out. Alright, well, that was a event. Wasn't really... Romantic, obviously it wasn't romantic, but wasn't really super friendly. It was more him trying to make me not fall out of the balloon. Oh well, at least he had fun. Yeah, just exactly what were we doing out there that he was just so worried about us falling out. But that was fun. 
our very last romantic festival. Actually, yeah, that would also be really cool if we went up at, like, sunset. And then watch the starry night, like, come into focus as the uh, sun goes down. Also, hi, Desi. Shame we can't take Desi up with us, although that might look a little unusual to everyone else if we just went up on it by ourselves. Alright, let's get out of here. We have some presents to deliver. Oh, right. Oh, well, thanks for that. Okay, so last year, yeah, we went to Syracuse. This year... Let's go over to... You know what? Let's go... Uh, no, I'm gonna spend New Year's with West Town. Let's go to Luga Coco. I did go to Syracuse last year, right? I kind of remember that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I went to Syracuse last year. I hope I went, because I don't want to repeat a town twice on accident. Alright, so let's give Helani a gift and Tigre absolutely nothing. Just to screw with them. No, we have to give Tigre a good gift. Uh, what would he like? Honestly, there's only one of these that's even remotely Lulu Coco themed. Alright, so that's Tigre. But yeah, I have a feeling he would like the muscle training things. He seems like someone who is really into fitness. Even though he's like, what? 12? Actually, no, he seems like around 10. Also, I've always found it so weird that the night sky looks like it's like... Super cloudy and ominous at night. Especially considering it's like supposed to be a clear night tonight with the whole starry night thing. Alright, so what would he like? He would prob- Ooh, actually he might like the treasure map. No, let's give him a fishing rod. I think he would like that. Wants to be just like his dad and everything. And Alma... Oh my god, no, let's not give her a book of handsome guys. Maybe juice making? She does like to cook. Yeah, let's give her a juice making kit. That might be the wrong choice, actually. She might prefer a kite. No, she does like it. Awesome. And hopefully he'll like the fishing rod. Oh, good. He does like the fishing rod. Alright, gave everyone the present that they deserved. Man, I wonder what would happen if I just completely messed up all the presents. But no, that would be really mean. Plus, it's pretty obvious for the most part what the people like. Usually you just pick the thing that, like, fits the town theme. Uh, Saluka, you might not want to make this a repeat performance. You had fun sneaking into people's houses, but maybe don't make it a habit. Anyways, I'm going to bed. Alright, so before we end the episode, I'm just going to run over to... Oh, I do want to make breakfast for uh, Saluka, too. Okay, I'm just going to run over... Actually, wait. I should probably do this before I go. Because I think by the time we get back, breakfast, breakfast time will be over. 
But yeah, let me see how she'll react to my chocolate fondue. For breakfast, obviously. Actually, do I still have ingredients for this? Yes, I do. So, awesome strawberry, okay cocoa, and awesome milk. And since everything's giant, we're gonna make like five dishes for her. So, let me see what she thinks about this. Also, I think I made a vegetable cake, too. Kind of looks like a vegetable cake. Oh, she loved it. Awesome. So, yeah, it depends completely on the star rating of your final food. Alright. Pretty good, then. Alright, so let's go check uh, what the tablet, how much it's going to cost to decipher it. And then after that, we'll call it an episode. Oh wow, there's a lot of people up here today. Alright, Mithra, how much money are you gonna need? Oh wait, oh that's right, I actually have to talk to you before you'll charge me money to decipher it. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip through the dialogue pretty quickly again. Cause like always, it's exactly the same. But yeah, I'm hoping I can get this one translated and solved before the LP ends. It's gonna really depend if I can get access to what I need. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I guess I can't pay her today. Darn it. Oh well. I'll have to pay her, or was it? I'll have to see if I can pay her tomorrow. But for now, I think I'll end things here. So, next time on Let's Play Story of Seasons, time for our very last Harvest Festival. I'm gonna enter a strawberry and demolish everyone. And then after that, it's New Year's time. So, till then.